uh, massage therapy school, they have like a whole chunk mm -hmm. just about like the emotional aspect mm -hmm. of, of like massage and stuff like that. And they're like, for, for you, what were some of the things about being a physical therapist that were, I guess, kind of unexpected or you just didn't really quite see as being a part of things for you? Um, can you like be more specific with that? Like, um, Ooh, so like when I first got into training, I didn't realize I was going to be dealing with so many people's emotions. Mm. I had no yeah. idea. That I mean, is like, a good point. Yeah, yep. that, it's literally one <laughs> of the craziest is. things that I ever dealt with. Yep. I had a, I had a, a mm -hmm. client like tell me that she was like cheating on her husband. And this is like nine years ago, but I was like, what the fuck? Like, and you're just I'm, like, <laughs> I was like, I'm 20. Uh, Why are you telling me this? Like, <laughs> you're like, I'm not that type of therapist. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I, yeah that, that does happen. You're just like, okay. you know, I just let people talk, you know, yeah. and I just listen, mm -hmm. you know, and um, especially if you're working one on one with people mm -hmm. and especially, you know, if they are getting good results from you. I mean, you do form like, so much of a relationship so people oh, yeah. do oh, yeah. learn to trust you and then they'll just open up to you and it's like i said i just let them talk you know i let them listen you know yeah. it's just because people are people and you know you gotta let them people are humans stuff, you know yeah. that's, that's it but i that is a good point i did not expect so much of that when i went into school totally catches yeah, you off guard yeah yeah it's like now yeah. you get like oh now i understand like the bartender or the hairdresser <laughs> yeah right know? right but it's the same thing i've had some patients tell me about like their spouses and everything it's like oh geez. oh yeah oh yeah <laughs> let's do they uh in, in uh, massage therapy school they have like a whole chunk mm -hmm. just about like the emotional aspect mm -hmm. of, of like massage and stuff like that. And they're like, Hey, you're going to learn everything about them mm -hmm. and they're going to ask about you and you need to just not like, yeah. Yeah. so that's, that was something else that did mm -hmm. surprise me too, was trying to limit mm -hmm. yourself in yeah. the conversation. Well, and then when you're doing like hands-on mm -hmm. work too, cause like I do a lot of like manual therapy yes. as well, you know, um, people store, you know, like traumas exactly. and whatnot in their tissue. Mm -hmm. So, uh, like, there's a really good book. I don't know if you've read it. Body called Keeps the, the Score. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Bessel yeah, van der Kolk. Yeah. Yep. Yep. So that's a really, really cool book. But um, yeah, I've had some patients where I'm doing some hands-on stuff with them and they'll they'll just start crying. You know, I remember I was working with a gentleman, this was years ago, and he asked me like, oh, like, have you ever had anyone like cry when you worked with them? And I think at that point I have had mm -hmm. like maybe one person, this was pretty early in my career, and he just started tearing up. Yeah. You know, you just accept that that can happen mm -hmm. and that's what it is. Yeah, yeah. it is. A, mm -hmm. It is really interesting, too, because it's uh, it's it really does honestly seem a lot of times almost less of like an emotional cry and more of like like a release cry. Yeah. Like just like, just like yeah. oh, my God, like, you know, mm -hmm. just something kind of getting like out of you, so to speak. It's um, mm -hmm. it's very strange. I, by the way, I have this funny little rule that if I hear about a book three times, I have to buy it. <laughs> I, ha I have talked about that book uh -huh. at least three times on this podcast. So anyone who has heard all three of those episodes, you have to buy that book now. The Body Keeps the yeah, Score by Vessel van der Kolk. It's yeah. just, it's really insightful. It's, it's really a really cool. great book. Yeah. yeah. I need to, I need to read it again, honestly. It's, mm -hmm. it's, it's so freaking good. Hey guys, if you got some value out of that question, please share it to someone else who needs to hear it. And uh, you, I'm talking to you right now. If you want to ask your own question, you can go direct message me on Instagram at Andrew PFM. You can go toss a comment on YouTube, on TikTok at Andrew PFM as well, or my business Instagram at Pride Fitness and Movement. Yeah. Hope to see you guys there. Later.